Hello guys, welcome back at True Sixty here, and welcome back to another GTA Five video. So guys, I am starting a kind of a new, I don't know, series. I don't know what you want to call it, of videos. So these will be my tip videos and helping you guys to do something in, I don't know, GTA or I don't know or whatever. So I hope you guys enjoy these tips and that. Yeah. So I hope you guys all enjoy and yeah, I hope this helps you. All right. So this is so for this video I was telling you a bit of a little maybe like a tip and a little bit of kind of a trick into making a bit of money in GTA 5 really quickly and easy. So you by doing this you should playing for about an hour you should make about five hundred thousand dollars depends on how good you are and all that. So yeah. So st the requirement for this is you need a CEO office and a vehicle warehouse. So. Here is my CEO office and here is my warehouse, my vehicle warehouse that has been covered. Alright, so step one for this is you need to call Pegasus and get a Hydra like I have right here. Get a Hydra, Buzzard, Savage, I don't know, whatever, or get, maybe get a vehicle from your hangar. So, so yeah, so step one is you need to register as a CEO, go to VIP work and start the mission Headhunter. Alright. And you gotta assassinate all the targets, right? So I was, so I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna show you what happens afterwards. All right, guys, we are back. So we have finished the assassinate headhunter. So we've assassinated all the targets, and you have earned 20 grand, 20 grand, or maybe 21 grand. It depends. So step two now is to get out of whatever you're in or land whatever, and go into your CEO office. So yeah, I'll show you in a second. My character would hurry up and deploy his bloody parachute. So yeah. Right. Going into your CEO office. Uh, so this, for doing this, it doesn't really matter what CEO office you have. I just have the one in Maze Bank because I like it. It's in the middle of the city, it's really good. So what you need to do is go in, go to your computer. So don't even listen to your assistant. No one gives a shit. So go, go log on to your CEO computer. And once you've logged in and sat down, you want to source a vehicle from your vehicle, vehicle warehouse. So you want to source one. And then once you've done that, so I'm gonna source this and I'll take it back to my warehouse and I'll show you what to do afterwards. All right, so guys, we are back. So here I have my car, I'm driving it. I'm gonna stay above 56 miles per hour until the bomb is disarmed. So basically, um, so we, what we did the headhunter mission for was to make 20 grand and usually in these missions, you usually get attacked or whatever, or you accidentally crash and you use that money to pay for this is what you do. So yeah, um, so you might just say, oh yeah, look, I've made 20 grand, yeah. You're so happy, but the thing is, um, you're gonna, you're gonna have to use it for this. Like my, my advice is to you is, if it goes above 10 grand, just destroy the car, don't, doesn't matter. If you can keep it under 10 grand, that's good. You've done really good work. So yeah, I gotta, so I'm just gonna drive this car. I've got the Banshee. 900R So this is the upgraded at Benny's and super now. So yeah Um, yeah, so I have the 10 I have the 20 grand so I've left it out just so I can show you guys this method So yeah, I have to, I even though I do have a bomb see look I just hit my I didn't even hit that car I only scratched it and I have to pay one grand now. I I, I kind of get it but still so yeah Let's drive this car to the warehouse. We're not that far off anyway. So yeah, just gonna drive all the way back. So yeah, if you have, okay, this, this kind of tip and trick video is more if you have no money you have a bit of money to call pegasus vehicle good for you 
Um, so yeah, that's what the city is. So I'm at my own house now. I have to pay the money. You should all know this by now. So what, so what you do is when you get to your own house, you lose that 20 grand. It depends on how much you, your car was hit, but still you can afford to do what we're doing next. So I, I didn't even take it out of there, but still. So now what you do is you go, you sit down, log on to this computer and you want to export your car. I hope I can do it there. Wow, I'll go wait for this. All right, I'll see you. I'll see you when this timer is finished because I, I don't want to do this in the video. All right, all right, I'll be back. All right, guys, we are back. So we have only four seconds left, but still. All right, so I kind of wanted to explain to you what is best for this. So while we wait for that. So basically, if you want to make a bit more money. So this tip is more of a solo thing. Not really, mo not really uh, kind of for other people, whatever. So if you really want to make more money, you want to do th these collections, like the four collections. Or just do a four sell, like sell four cars. Or, yeah, do that. So, you mainly earn more of a bonus from doing, like, these. But still, up to you guys. Do whatever you want. All up to you. So, yeah. Alright, so you may have your car. So, what you're doing now, once you have your car, is... So, if you have completely no money to modify it. So, if you want to fully modify it, you have to pay 7500 It's just for this car. So, it depends on what range it is so if it's standard range it's like seven thousand five hundred medium you have to pay 20 grand and then like high range i don't know because i've never got a high range car so yeah so if you have no money you want to do a private dealer and you get f f 15 grand depends on what car it is so that if you have a bit of money but you don't want to spend so if you have enough to afford the specialist deal but you don't want to spend it you can do showroom dealer and you have to so you just do standard modifications so it's basically a respray change i think it is and that's it and then you have to click a print group and then yeah but if you want to do what i do is go full room dealer you get to take out tracker change it whatever so yeah so let's modify this banshee uh let's go red secondary color let's go hot pink I am paid well below my skill level. so yeah you can modify so this is what you get with just um uh, full modification but if you don't pay this you don't get this So you can probably tell I recorded this on during Halloween. Neon, change them red. Skirt, take those off because they look bloody ugly. Spoiler. And me level spoiler. Okay, okay. We'll go that and windows block them out change tires so basically this is kind of like a modification but you don't have to pay you do have to pay but not that much that's what that's what I kind of like about this. It does. It's not every single car in the game. It's only certain cars with certain updates. So let's go. So yeah, just gonna de deliver the car and that's it. So, uh, so yeah, that is it for this video. Hope you guys all enjoyed. Ho I hope this video really helped you guys out. And yeah, if you like if you like this this tip video and you want me to do more of these, please make sure to put your suggestions down below in the comments. Tell me if you liked it or you don't like it or yeah. So I hope you guys will enjoy it and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye bye.